With the news in the industry today, there is a lot of effort to try to identify any software that is leveraging OpenSSL. Many of these attempts are using web connection monitoring, looking for web servers using HTTPS connections to identify web servers that are using OpenSSL. With Tanium's approach, we go beyond just looking for web applications. We drive into looking for artifacts on disk that are identifying characteristics of web applications beyond just web servers that could be using OpenSSL. Here I'll show you how to use the Tanium SBOM solution. With this solution, using a simple question, SBOM discovered packages, I'll filter this for the OpenSSL software that we're concerned about, and this will give me an inventory of every place that's identified this shared library inside of my estate by looking at the artifacts on disk. Now I can further filter this to look for only the version 3 sets of software that are of concern in the industry today. This will help me to identify and be able to start the plan to remediate this software as we go forward. In addition, our SBOM package includes a number of dashboards. You'll see that we have several identified proactively this one includes specifically the OpenSSL dashboard. This OpenSSL report will identify artifacts on disk that we were able to link back to OpenSSL, the version that they include, 1.0, 3.0, whatever we found we will report. We also show you where on disk that endpoint has that affected binary, in addition to the hash value that was calculated for that particular set of files. What you'll find with this dashboard is we help you to identify where the affected binaries are so that you can get ahead of trying to plan on how to remediate or patch this particular vulnerability in the near future.